Arundhati and this is part of our Ask Me Anything challenge that we're running at Aham Yoga. We asked all our viewers to submit questions related to yoga poses, yogic diet, yogic lifestyle, just about anything under the blanket of yoga and we're answering them for you via our YouTube channel as well as our blog found at ahamyoga.com. If you would like to see all the other questions that people have asked us, then just hit the subscribe button below or like us on Facebook and you can see every video that we've released in this series. We also have a few blog posts that have come out and that are available on the website at ahamyoga.com. Our next question comes to us from Rebecca and this is one of my favorite questions. She says, a lot of sports practitioners now recommend yoga as a good supplement to their practice. What's the best sport or activity to supplement yoga? Now, Rebecca, this is a great question. Okay. I do know that the Seattle Seahawks themselves practice yoga here and a lot of other teams across the US practice yoga as well. Now, for me, yoga is complete by itself. You have strength training, flexibility training, you have endurance training, you work with your breath, there is a certain mindfulness that comes in with yoga practice, there are meditative practices, you are increasing your lung capacity, you're maintaining all your systems in the body to function well through the um, healthy practice of yoga poses. So for me, yoga as a practice is complete, it does not need to be supplemented with any other sport or activity, but having said that, it is a personal preference. It depends on you, what, what goals you have, what kind of lifestyle do you need, what your body composition is like. Some people need to do a little more cardio, some people need to do less of cardio, some of us need to do more strength training, maybe a little bit of toning. So what I'm trying to say is the answer to this is individualized. Okay? As much as yoga is complete, you don't need anything else. But if you are looking to balance it out with something else, then it could be swimming, it could be running, it could be biking, it could be um, basketball. So that answer can be given to you more on a one-on-one -on -one basis, depending on what your goals and your needs are. But know that yoga on its own is a complete practice. It has all the components and is, is well balanced. Sports practitioners, uh, sports people use it as a recovery because there is so much impact that comes from all the cardio that they're doing. It is also so stressful to be part of a team and to play play all these matches and to be on the go all the time. So yoga for these practitioners is, is recovery. The practice helps to repair the body. It helps to rejuvenate the systems. It also brings in a certain amount of groundedness and concentration and the ability to focus when you're in this in the stadium full. There's adrenaline and there's people screaming and there is so much of a blood rush that's going on. Yoga helps to calm you down. It makes you focus on what is most important. That is the game. Okay, so that's why they use it as a recovery. But know that. With your, just yoga itself is, is a great practice. 